uh, to kind of to further buttress the uh, issue of the comments, how to do comments, and uh, have it allocated to each of the students. Furthermore, what we need to do once we are at the dashboard, you click on the dashboard, your dashboard uh, plate will move sideways. As you can see, it's popping sideways. You click on it, the dashboard pops sideways, and that's fine. So you go ahead to report that after. Go to report. Click on report. Click on report. It's report you are going to click on. You can see what I'm doing here. I'm clicking it out and in. Click on report and then pick on student grade report. Once you click that, wait for it to open up itself. And once it opens, straight away, pick your class group. I'm picking junior secondary school class group for this particular teacher and you don't need to come to class arm. Just pick the report type, individual class report, not class arm report. Individual class report, not class arm report. Individual class report. So once you pick that, don't come to class arm. You know why I have not structured it to understand the class arm structural way? Because we found out that there are some session in the school like, okay, GSS 3, grade format is different from gss2 and gss1 and ss3 grade format third term is different from uh ss1 and ss2 and that way because of that it does not follow a class arm structure it follow an individual class structure so fine we are not going by the way of class arm we are going by the way of class so that's why we are stressing here that we pick on individual class report and we don't want to come to class arm as such we go ahead to class and then let's say i'm picking gss2 pair so i pick on that the session is by default 2020-2021 session that's where we are now and you can see the students showing their numbers and that's fine so now this is area of emphasis when you click on term please you want to do comments don't do your comment on first term. Don't do your second term. Don't do on third term. If you do on third term, the comment will only show up on the student's third term report. But we are capturing the whole session. It's going to be an annual report card. And as such, we are going to click, click on session report. The session report captures all of, in all of the activities of the student from the beginning of the term till the last day in the term. And so we are picking on the session report. It encompasses the first term, the second term, and the third term. And such, we are picking on it. And lastly, here is a CA to show. Individual CA, because I understand the school wants them to see what the student has scored for 15, the second 15, and then the overall exam 70. And that's fine. So we are not combining the CA. If you click on combine CA, it's going to merge 15 and 15 together, make it 30. We don't want to do that. So you go to individual CA. And as such as you've done that, just submit. Submit the report that you are querying. And as soon as you submit that, it's going to take you straight to uh, a template for Abdul Salam or PME's results. So it's loading up now. And I'm waiting for that. And as soon as it's load up, I will have the template. And then I will move down a bit to uh, pick on my comment and then save it and as soon as i've saved it i've been able to do justice to that it's raining here and so the network is a bit sluggish so bear with me so we have it now now as part of what i'm saying you can see this is first time you can see 15 15 exam second time and then third time so that's those are the columns for them and then you want to come to class teachers comment if you have done comment i have not done comment if you have done comment the comment will come will pop down some said i don't want to go to grades to do comment well if you don't want to do great to do comment and you have copied your comment somewhere what you just do now is just to click on your comment copy it paste here okay a well behaved student student and then you submit the web is student and you submit 
And that comment has been saved for that particular child. Has been saved for that particular student. And that's this is where to come. So you can see you are make you are commenting on the basis of the entire session. You are not commenting on the basis of just first time, second time, or third time. The comment we are going to do each educator we come to select time and they will pick on session report, please. They will click on select time and pick on session report, please. So we should not pick on anything. So you want to do your comment, come to report, our report side, click on student grade report, and then you come here, as I've said, select the class group, junior secondary, senior secondary, and the likes. Select this, the report type, individual class report, don't come to ham don't select the class ham don't select the class ham leave it blank come to class select your class the session should come by default if it does not come pick your 2021 2020 2021 session which is the current session and then you have your student you pick them i want to go to the next student i'll pick the student up and as soon as i'm done i'm done with abdul salam or pay me jamie now so and then the next is to submit again once i submit it's going to change this Abdul Salam of Bayemi to Abia Natasha. Please, when you click and submit, please wait until this template loads in. Abia Natasha Ayers report. We have to wait. I'm waiting now. You can see my uh, my 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 uh, my icon is hovering. It's, it's, it's rolling. I will wait until it stops so that it generates me the template for abia natasha i'm waiting abia natasha is going to fetch the report now it has fetched the report now you can see it has changed to abia natasha and that's when i can go ahead and do comment for abia natasha okay a responsible girl or what i want to put there and then once i have submitted once i submit it's fine and as you as i've said once you put the comment you will see responsible responsible student so once you click on submit you you will see you say data updated successfully and that comment is there you come there any day anytime check it it's there nothing can change it X, nothing 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 it's there and that's when we are done the job. Thank you so much and let us have a good